Das Vidania, comrades! Today we take Soviet Dragon to frozen... frozen monkey place. Oh, who are you? Are you a famous music composer? <laughs> um, my, my name is uh, Cheeky Bricky. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> so, so it's monkey day today. It's monkey day, and like last monkeys. time, if you remember, we picked up the last power-up. I didn't remember that, because the power-ups are not very interesting. Well, you're right. <laughs> oh, but Ice Press is here now. So. <laughs> entertain the game for a second here. <laughs> we get the fourth elemental breath, Ice! That's pretty sweet, so now we have, like, Captain Planet powers. Um... Well, we have this. Alright. Which so it's, it, This. Uh, okay. Transparency effects, ooh. It makes enemies frozen in a block, but the, the block can't actually be stood on. What? That's the dumbest shit! <laughs> <laughs> Was it too hard to make them flat? Do you think that'd be easy? Making things flat is really easy in computer land. Uh, uh, hey, there's this challenge we didn't do yet. Oh yeah? Because oh, we didn't yeah. have the ice breath. It's the final dragonfly of the Hubble World. Couldn't we have just like flipped some dirt on it with our, our wing scoops? Um, it's... <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm not helping very much. <laughs> <laughs> your logic, your logic does not belong here, friends. No power here. Sorry, Spyro. I know that's not how you do. But now we're helping prevent forest fires. We're responsible. Uh oh. I was. I got roped into the dialogue. <laughs> no. The timer's still going now. Oh. oh my God. Woo. You're the best, Spyro. You smell nice. And you've got great hair. <laughs> <laughs> well, he's got frill up the middle of his head. Okay, if you count as hair. That's kind of That's like a pretty hair. sweet mohawk. Yeah. Um, and he can well. never trim it off, or there'll be so much blood. Now we can actually go to the level. Take the, the Monkey Town Ferry across, across the Cloud Sea. Great job, young dragon! That should be enough to get more balloon Crankle? working. Hop aboard! Is he Australian? Um, I think... <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's pretty good. Uh... Oh, pretty good thing you got in that balloon with you in it. Yeah. Like, this this, this yeah. totally happened. That's you. That's what you did. Even when you actually get in the balloon, sometimes you, like, clip through it when it goes up, so... Man, it, I'm so surprised. It doesn't matter. <laughs> I pay attention to the, vo the voice here. Okay. Those unbalanced riptocks have invaded our sacred monastery. It's different, right? Of course. It's this is still, still this is compassion. still Brother Krankel. So really it's the that same name brother. as the guy I know we brother just talked Krankel. to two seconds ago. <laughs> this is some other guy. That, that's, <sighs> that's BS. It's Krankel too. Like you, you could give him a different name. Nobody would care, and it would <laughs> make more sense. Right. All right. Here, Monkey Monastery. All right. I like this level. This is probably my favorite level of all the ones we've seen so far. It looks pretty. Um, look at all these gems here, lying around. Five gems! There's purple gems here! There's even <laughs> gonna be yellow gems. Remember purple gems? I do. Um... This is also the le uh, this is the best level so far, but it's also the level that borrows the most from previous Spyro games. So there maybe a there's a there? correlation there. <laughs> That's up to you to decide. But here, this level here um, has a lot of similarities to the Spyro 3 levels of, uh, if you remember, Frozen Altars and Icy Peak. I, I don't remember anything ever, but I'll take your word for it. And ice skating is back. That's awesome. For the and there. Level ever. And there I say it, it controls better than it did in Spyro 2. Whoa. In Spyro 3. Like, like, you have more con- You're faster and you- You're faster and you have the control. Like, it isn't as... Ice-y. <laughs> it's like, it's- That's better around. because- Oh, like... But do we get to play hockey using this new ice cream? 
fair enough. There's no hockey in here, uh, so Colossus still will always have that. <laughs> There's a dragonfly behind that door, and I thought I could have maybe gotten it through the no. door. You just hear him mocking you. Uh, mm -hmm. Another return? Treasure chest. I don't remember... what? Chest in my Spyro? Yeah, the Spyro games have sometimes have had chests and you have to find a key later in the level to open it up. Oh, and that's okay. exactly what's going on here. Alright, alright, I'll take your word for it. <laughs> Thanks, Brother Cranko. Crankle Free. <laughs> Um, <laughs> With the ring shield, we can do this. Oh man! Yeah, and that's fun. The ring shield is more awesome here than it is ever awesome for the rest of the entire game. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> these these tiny mammoth here, mammoths here are enemies from Frozen Alter. Like straight up. Okay. Yep. Well, not the same model exactly. Yeah. But there were also here. tiny mammoths there. Um, look at this guy. He is immune to breaths. Like all breaths? All breaths, because he has a shield. Oh, that a tiny shield that doesn't really. He's got like a buckler. Well, it's this is like one of the this is the second. How we're over halfway through the game and uh, we finally see Spyro. a metal-clad enemy. I know you've heard the <laughs> of scary monsters, but we another did, return. Which is why we live from Spyro Three. If you remember, this is Bartholomew. The true this monsters is are the rip Bentley's little brother or cousin or friend. And imprison them in the ice. Oh yeah! You save the five yeti Bizarre! The I'm amazed any of them remembered previous characters at all. And he has a lot to say. Yes, yes. We have to save some yetis. Spyro. Um, Spyro. His animation, like, he, he, he doesn't really look <laughs> better for it, I'd say, but he, he's in here. Um, At least he's, you know, got, he's got a job. At least he's working. No mention of Bentley or how they came to live here, but who cares about that? It, it hurts too much to talk about. Um, but those enemies, yes, they are immune to... That, like, if, if you remember in the sp previous Spyro games, like, you had metal clad enemies, and if you flame breathe it on them, they just light up because yeah. they're immune. But now they, they, these dinosaurs just have a tiny shield, and that makes them immune to all breaths. All breaths forever. And there's no distinct animation like displaying that they are immune to breaths, no. they just don't, don't take yeah. damage. Pretty much. And with the hitboxes on the breaths, you can never, like, I'm sure the first couple times people were like, does it not work because I missed, or does it not <laughs> work because it doesn't yeah. work? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, that was a big enemy. You couldn't charge him normally, but if you freeze him, you can. So, okay. if you. Yeah, that's, that's something. So, I mean, there it is. overall, the ice ice breath is worse because it doesn't kill anything outright, and your charge or flame will. Yeah, but yeah. there's, you know, <laughs> you can play a little. <laughs> now you can taunt them before they die. Greetings, young dragon. I believe the turret behind you could be a very useful weapon for you to use on your quest. We use it for our annual snowball war. Oh, it's quite an event. Oh, Although we are a non-violent people, we do have our vices. Perhaps you might want to glide over there and try it out. I really want to go to the Monkey Snowball War. Yeah. That sounds awesome. You may be a this is not going to be as Spyro, awesome, but, you have but it is going to be a... It's pretty much oh. another re another mechanical return of, uh, of this little turret there. If you yeah. Remember. That one I actually do remember, because... I don't know. Oh, Wait. that gem fell um, off. Oh, 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 um, oh, it's back. It's fine. back. Okay. It just, it just fell into the wormhole down there. It's yeah. back now. It just had to fall through the entirety of the universe to return. Yep. 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 Yeah. Every game always seems to think it's a good idea to do stationary gun shooting sections. It's not, it's not necessarily good. Well, these don't look like snowballs, right? Yeah. <laughs> these monkeys yeah. play hard, man. 
say. No, there's no like challenge to do here. You just shoot the doorways up. Yeah. Okay. Alright. That's what, how they were used previously. Like that's yeah. that's fair. Um, well, I'd much rather have that than have you like do like a time to kill fifteen flying bugs to pursue the thing. Ouch. What? Uh. 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 What? <laughs> You're right, that once is you, really repeatable. Yeah, isn't yeah. When, when, once, like, if you know how it works, then you can just do it. It's the easiest thing in the world. So I'm gonna get this thing early. Oh, oh. No, I don't! I embarrassed myself! <laughs> right in front of everybody! Ah. Stupid dragon fight! This time for real? No, no, I'm not even oh. gonna try. Like, I'm, oh. I'm too ashamed. <laughs> Never again. Hey, buddy. Is he flat? He looks flat on top. Oh, I like the cold, but I don't like it that much. Dude, your face. <laughs> Dude, your face. Uh, yeah. Yeti, My Yeti goodness. returns too. Yeah. Return of Yeti. Well. <laughs> yep. Yeah, we free him from his icy prison. Counter goes down, and we return him to his icy prison. Well, he's a yeti. They're dangerous, right? <laughs> you, you seem pretty friendly, but <laughs> much like Nigel Thornberry, he is friendly, but also dangerous to be around. Oh, there we go. Well, okay. But now, because there was ice under us in that normal ground, <laughs> we are skating in the air. Air skate. Whoa. That's bizarre. I can just do this. This is very peaceful. <laughs> and we can go to the edge of the level here. Oh, that's. Um. Don't 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 pay attention to the second sparrow uh, below you. Uh, um. He's not really there. <laughs> <laughs> this is all working just fine. We can go under the ice. <gasps> what? It sort of at least gets the gems. This is so relaxing. Just with no walking animation. You're just a... Yeah. Just... Just a celestial being. Oh, uh-uh. When, when, when you got too close to the ground, the game all correct. <laughs> oh well. Still, we've just played dominance over the games. <laughs> Surely you can't mess with us. You can't bound me by gravity. Oh. Jeff failing at the complex spiral combat mechanics. I kind of fall and get hit a lot this episode. <laughs> well, you're too busy enjoying the ambiance. Because it is a pretty level. Like, I, I, I think there's a the palette and everything in this one. Absolutely. Um, the music is not my favorite, but it's, it's still very rem very classic Spyro's. So it's still very good. Yeah. Um, so like, it's, it's, it has all the pieces to make a good Spyro level. Um, it's in it's in this in in this really janky engine still, and you know like it's, it's a bit underdeveloped. But yeah, if it is, wasn't in this in this particular game, it would be a perfectly decent Spyro level. Or at least, not embarrassing. I am Bad. enjoying my time in this level. That is all that counts. Well, <laughs> that's that's how the snowballs work. Teach me how the snowballs work. Oh, oh no! <laughs> oh my gosh. This is the uh, Just a Friend Reel of Shame as well. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Oh, great Spyro Master. Show me how to fall in a pit. Alright, look at this. Did what you see the that? Hell? Behind that the back. was some L MLG shit right there. Okay, you're redeemed entirely. Yeah. <laughs> um, also, while I'm talking to Marcus here, those two other Rhinox are still attacking me. 
Why are you avoiding? Why are you avoiding? <laughs> well, I'm invincible. We'll be with you in a moment, Rip Dog. Wow. Rude. I like the sound clip. It's, it's, it's really hype. Peaceful. Time to die! Yeah, enemies don't really freeze in the animation that they no, were they, in. They, they just go to the, the predetermined. Like the, the T-pose. Yeah, kind, kind Broken of. Fallout mods. <laughs> or a lot of broken anything that involves 3D models. Well, what's going on? Oh, uh, frames! Okay. We got we, the, we got the frames back. There was just a little bit too much on screen. We had a little frame clog, but it's okay now. Alright. Um, so, what Marcus said is we need to kill those three pterodactyls there. Okay. And that then we get, easy. Right. So that's our challenge with this thing. But we, we can't actually... There's two turrets. And this one turret can only shoot that one bird, and the other turret can shoot the other two. Oh. But I have a... Like, you know, like... I'm not gonna do it that way. We can do it another way. We're gonna do it the Chaff's way. Right, check the this slow out. strut. I'm gonna redeem myself again. <laughs> right. Oh, no way, bro! I got him! Oh, and... Ooh! Nice! Stick the landing! Turrets are for babies. Where's the other one? Dog fighting is for men and dragons. Manly dragons. They can't even attack you, it's just kind of. <laughs> They're just a hurt box that flaps. Well. <laughs> Good enough. Mission accomplished. You can rest now, soldier. I, I did it on purpose so I would be. be like a little bit closer to uh, oh, it, be. it was a skip. I got you. You're taking damage to save time. Also, for some reason, like but once you do it, like a little bit later, Sparks gives you the thing, even though the guy's right there. <laughs> hey, it's um, Goku. It's it's Goku's cousin, Gaku. <laughs> Gaku. Ah, <I'm> fucking Gaku. <laughs> Gaku's using the Kimihama! Those flying Riptox won't be bothering us again. Yeah, because yep. they're dead. Also, I like how everything that has got scales or feathers is apparently a Riptox. Or a cow is also got a Riptox. Yeah, I... Yeah. I think the anti Riptox propaganda really got out of hand in <laughs> Spiral Land. It's, it's so nice and peaceful, this float. Mm. I'm just really into purples and blues. Good colors. I'm a, I'm a winter palette. That's my personality. Man, that snowball war is gonna be so boss. With rapid firing snow turrets. Mm. Wow. I, I definitely didn't. Fall down while trying to <laughs> glide over here. It's okay, you disguised it so well, no one will ever know, Jeff. <laughs> it's a good thing you came along when you did, Dragon. Oh, man. Yetis have really good diction. Yep. Bye. <laughs> that won't save them, but they speak very well. Way better than the dumb pigs. There is the uh, end portal. Oh, okay. All right. But there's still some level after this. Look, they're perfectly in sync. Ah, I got them both. The pygmy mammoths are super cute. Right. Just saying. Yeah, 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 I can see that. <laughs> Hello, Spyro. Right. I made it's this. It's the Fourth of July. Display, but oh, it's to time light to it. celebrate, America. Can you? Your flame breath to light Time to burn this place down. 
Are you Time ready for, for it? Drunken irresponsibility. Woo! Yeah! That was amazing! Uh-oh. No, my holiday! <laughs> Wow! Look at them. That was more than I expected, but uh, hey, what, what did you expect? More. There was nothing. That was, that was more than he expected. Did you expect it not to like take off at all? Because that's what happened. Wow! That was more than I. Stuff it up your ass, brother Ian. Yeah. Yeah. Enjoy your frozen hell. You probably won't because it's a hell. He got free. Yeah, I gotta say, as a fireworks display goes, this is a very um. Ouch. Oh, no, it's Ouch. oh no, it's, buddy. It's, a, it's, a, it's okay. Look, look, look at this. Look, look. Oh, is this a skip? I'm. I'm. I'm Noah. I'm, I, this is where I need to be. Yeah. I totally don't turn back here, and then realize, oh, this is where I need to be. <laughs> You glide here. Oh, this wow, perfect, perfect. <laughs> Just wow, I'm, the best. I'm the best. Oh man, look at us using that inventory for something. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Oh. It's a skip, right? Mm-hmm. 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 It's not a skip. Don't lie to me. Like, in, uh, if you if you do that, and then in <laughs> 2026. Okay. Um, Go on. Spyro will uh, say, "I'm out," <laughs> and then you launch us to the moon. Oh, that's totally worth waiting uh, another eleven years. Yep. <laughs> Man, in little eleven years, I wonder if anybody will remember this. I kind of hope not. <laughs> Spyro, the Rip Tuck's having made it our land and Wow! Rude! <laughs> <laughs> no, I meant Spyro 4, not our LP. We're the only living plane? record. Destroy the oh, this, this looks like a pretty fun shooting things in an airplane segment, right? Uh, the last one with the same plane was pretty bad. Yeah. yeah. But I like this one, actually. I like both minigames in this level. What? Because this one... You just go around, flying around this area, and you you just blow up all the things, and the missiles auto home. So it's okay. Okay. So and it's just like a rampage. Yeah. Yeah. There's no super like nine million hit point fuck blips. Nope. Everything dies. Uh, that's my my. That's my This is great, you just get to pick on Riptogs, shell their factories, burn down their homes. Which, frankly, they deserve. Of course. <laughs> and Filthy even if. Rip dogs. Even if you just fly into stuff, you just come back. It's no big deal. And, and, and with, the same, with the same amount of factories. It's like. That, that plane is made out of pliable material. It's it's all good. Yeah, it's a car it's a cartoon plane. It's uh, made for the uh, the, the goof troop Air Force. And that's it. Yeah, all right. Short, really short and simple. Pretty inoffensive. I found this dragonfly in one of the factories. In inoffensive <laughs> is <laughs> it translates to great in my book. <laughs> well, relatively speaking. The, uh, the the other mini game is actually great. We'll see that at the end of the video. That is it's actually great. Do you play tic tac toe against the chicken? Like. <laughs> no. Alright. Destroy the rip top turret. Because that would be impossible. You can't be in chicken and tic tac toe. Okay, <laughs> come back later. Fair, you I can help us out. Why is the little tiny baby dragon insisting that we like engage in open war? That's really weird. Well, no, there aren't a lot of dragons around, so somebody has to lead the military, and Baby Mandy can do it. I guess Spyro's not much more than a baby, and he's already, like, the hyper hero of all time, so... <laughs> I was 
I don't think I've ever heard somebody oh. talk about bombing factories. Whoa, places. what happened? I feel like an ice lolly. Did those rip talks put me on ice? He gads. Thank you, Spyro. Ice, he ice, said, ice? Baby? He said gads. Gads. But it said gosh. <laughs> I don't know. We caught you, stupid Yeti. Go back to stupid Yeti school. Um, what's over here? I don't remember. Uh, I want you to go to the chest, please. Oh yeah, we do need to go back to the chest. <laughs> now that I've been reminded the chest exists, and now we have a key, I'm, I'm dying with curiosity. Yeah, I bet it just yeah, has a bunch you'll... of gems, but. Those tricky rip talks caught me off guard, Spyro. Many thanks for your help. That's what you get, Yeti, for making that face. You get a scary face. Ouch. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> ah, I get uh, fucked it up. Wild blocks. Ah, I just can't. Oh, Ouch. oh, oh my uh, god, it's ruined. Well, to be fair, with the incline, you would have gotten knocked out of it anyway. So, <laughs> yeah, don't feel too. Deep. Hey, cheerio, Spyro. That's a good dragon. Okay. All right. Fair enough. Yeah, all right. <laughs> um, that's your line. Okay. Gotcha. And uh, now all the yetis have been briefly thawed and returned to their. Yep. State. We flip back to the beginning of the level. Yeah. Just like a Skyrim dungeon. Man, that door is seriously open. First, this chest here. Are you ready oh. for a loot explosion? Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Cool. What's cool. good again? Kicking red. Oh. Hey, hey, it's young. Hey, it's young. It's young. And then, and then it gives no, and no, and then, and then it gives you the sort of moments. And that's he, too bad. And he man's god piece. Uh, Chests exploding into uh, gems. It's pretty great, but yeah, yeah. They couldn't put like some gems in there with with him. <sighs> my heart hurts. Thank you, Spyro. The but that's Yeti probably just will my always welcome hands. you with open arms. Um, about the Yetis, uh... Hey, it's Jewelwing. Jewelwing? What? That's not a name even for a fucking dragon, that's... What? Sure it is. <laughs> Ouch. Nice. You got the, the standing animation glitch combo into the airwalk. I go back normally. No, we're just going back to oh, okay. that door that opened. But we can do it like this. Okay, we, we can make it. Okay, sweet. And we could have done that without the door opening. Oh, because we just went over the door. We could just flip through <laughs> it. But, so, like the the, you know. the door jam is not real. The door is real. Yeah, gotcha. the door is real. I, I I couldn't stick my head in the door and. <laughs> Flash shoe there, but that one. I bet that Riptox hands get really cold. Well, yeah, he's re he's wielding a club made out of ice. Yeah, and I mean, like he's probably cold blooded, so that's he's really suffering. They must really want to kill you. Huh? <laughs> Twenty minutes later. Hey, it's Damsel. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Damsel and Jewelwing. They're my favorite members of my Earth Circle. We're approaching here in the final, uh, final stretch here. Uh oh. There's this one dragonfly you're sitting here. He's just hanging, looking into the here. abyss. Beginning of the level. This is here. He just does not even run away. Yeah. Yeah, yeah it's happy. 
I was expecting him to fall hey, off. Hey, it's yeah. Shadow. What is with the t names? It, I mean, he wasn't even he was he wasn't even black colored. Yeah. Or purple. Or even like dark blue would be totally fine. But all right, whatever. You know what? Somebody is named Jewel Wing apparently. So carry on. Yeah. Here we go. This is the last. Oh. I see. I see bullseyes. No, I don't. I see monkey insignias. Okay. What do you think it is? You have a couple seconds. Uh, it is a Smash Brothers brawl analog where you fight as a monkey against a bunch of rip ducks. Welcome to our ancient slide, Spyro. Get no. Oh, it's, a, it's an ancient slide. Right. Ancient slide. More time. What? You can make it to as good or better. Right? Slides are fun. I'd say it's better. Ride the slide. Ride, there were ride, slides ride. before, but this one's a little different. It's like a like actual actual alpine sports. Well, you have to go through between the flags, but it's these penguins. Oh, oh my god! Oh no! Thank you. What? You can jump. Um, it's basically so right. You ever notice, wow. Jeff, that a lot of games we've played, well, you've played and I've talked dead, have slides yeah. involved? Like, we, we oh, yeah, yeah, Alice had a lot of slides, too. They were a little more, they were more covered in herpes than these are. Most impressive. What? You are not a slider yet. That was pretty impressive. Would you like to try our pizza? Pretty sweet. I fell in, I fell in the pit <laughs> and, and lived? That's pretty impressive. Yeah. But let's do it for real now. Oh no! I'm not gonna do it for real because. Oh no! Shagas. Only at five, five seconds! That's plenty of time, right? Oh my god! Oh, no! That was a, a couple of frames from where the timer would have ended. <laughs> That's uh. Oh gosh. Did you throw your controller in rage? No. Now I'm gonna do it for real. Um, Did that first leg not count? Oh, you just don't get time, okay. Every time you go in between flags, you get extra time. Gotcha. There's a diverging path here. You're gonna take the baby path. <laughs> it looks like it's it's pretty tightly timed anyway. If you're feeling it. If you if you don't go through the flags, you won't make it. Not super tight, but controls are, are, are you know, it's, it's a little slidey. Oh, well, yeah. It's fun! That's how it should be. Spyro's always been a pretty good slider. In our long association, I've seen him slide many times. Oh, we're totally making it this time! Yeah, we don't even need those flags. Fuck them. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you stupid monkeys. I can Just trying to preserve the magic. Reverse the slide. If you slide, if you slid upwards all the way back, if you could do that. <laughs> Man, they slide down here, and there's just like a cul-de-sac with a tent like a pagoda. How do they? How do you get back? Do monkeys have instant transmission? This, this is a dangerous route. Oh God! Um. Would you like to try our peaceful slide? Spark again? says there's a second slide. Is it just the but other it's, route? It's it's the same slide. Just the timer is a little a little shorter. So you gotta do it faster. So now we're gonna do it super cool for real. <laughs> I am gonna maximum power. Check this out. Snap. Yeah. Sick air. Oh, yeah. the danger zone. The danger weapon. Oh, the time is already very low. No, but look at this. Look, look at this. Oh, yeah. Snap. Yeah. That's not really. Oh, my God. We've already rejoined. 
it looks a little more terrifying. It's tighter, I guess. But that's about it. The fact that it force feeds you like 15 seconds. All right. So we have plenty of time, but I want to land the timer on a good number. So let's do that. Okay. Okay. Uh, do this. Uh, okay. One frame of this. Okay. Oh, uh, Jeff, you're the best. <laughs> yeah. Nice work, bra. <laughs> I'm a child. <laughs> I'm still. I'm pretty goddamn impressed. Really like no lie. That's. Um, how many takes of that thing? <laughs> no joke. It took me a long ass time because, yeah, it's a 60 FPS game and you have to do it. <laughs> frame uh, to a hundredth of a second. That's oh. uh. That takes a while. Oh god. <laughs> Still, it was totally worth it. Yeah, it's totally worth it so you could see sex number. Oh, yeah! Ah, it's great, right? Oh, my God. What is, uh... What am I doing? <laughs> <laughs> when did I lose control of my life? Whatever, hey, we eat. We just need this last gem here. From this enemy we didn't kill. Or the, the gem that, fall, that fell in the... In the floor. We're all done. Hooray! All right, now we can rest in peace. What uh, <sighs> what's what's next on our spiral dragon? Ah, that's the thing. The audience will have to vote again. The last time there are three levels left, but we can't go in the last level yet. Oh, well, that's the final boss is open, by the way. It opens at sixty-five percent. We're at oh. sixty-seven now. Weird. But the last level isn't open yet. We need sixty-five dragonflies. Okay, so um, we can either go to Honey Marsh or the Thieves Den. Yes, that's oh. up to the viewers. We're gonna I know what I want. Either of those. Yeah, which is? Monkeys! 